Hello and welcome to Lightworks. In this tutorial we're going to have a look at dragging and dropping clips around the timeline. This will help us modify the edit by moving and rearranging the shots. I'm just going to pick up one shot, drag and drop it straight to the timeline and release it. When we're picking up clips and moving them around on the timeline it's important to know where to click on the clips with the mouse head. Imagine the clip is divided into thirds. The first third, you see the mouse head, becomes the incoming trim icon to enter trim mode. In the central third, you see the mouse head has a black arrow pointing left and right. This is what you want to see when you're dragging and dropping segments. And in the final third, you see the mouse head returns to the trim, the out point icon. I'm just going to add a few more shots to this sequence. I'm going to click the first shot, press shift, and click the last shot. This enables me to select the range in the bin. I'm going to pick these up, click and hold with the left mouse button, drag and drop, and place them down at the end of this yellow segment. When you're moving shots around on the timeline, the default edit mode is replace. If I click and hold, and pick up this purple clip, wherever I drop it, the material will be replaced. And where we've extracted it or lifted it out, we're going to replace that area of the timeline with black. Just undo that. If you'd like to drag and drop a clip and insert it elsewhere on the timeline, you need to use the shift modifier to change the drag and drop mode to insert. So, click and hold and move the clip. Now press the shift key. You see the mouse head changes to insert. Now, if I just pop this purple clip just at the head of the blue clip and release the mouse. The purple clip has been spliced in ahead of the blue clip and where we've lifted out the purple clip again we've left a gap and overwritten with black. Press undo. When you lift out the shot and move it you may want to close the gap from where you're taking the shot from. To do that you need to press the shift modifier first. Press shift, click and drag and now you can see in the background the gap's being closed. Now I'm free to insert this shot wherever I'd like. I'm going to drop it in there and we're left without a gap. Press undo. You may want to close the gap and use a replace drag and drop. So let's see that one more time. Press shift first. Click and hold with the mouse. The mouse head says insert mode. If I now release the shift key the mouse head returns to drag and drop replace mode. Now wherever this lands the gap will be closed from where it came from and the target media will be replaced. Release and that's replaced. We hope that's helpful. Thanks for watching.